today in crypto price action looking bullish in my opinion a lot of green over here in the crypto sphere it would appear uh, we do see one project standing out experiencing you know 57 percent in upside it would appear project ton coin um, experiencing some uh, nice gains here um, some decent upside for um, its uh, you know investors and holders uh, we do see coin symbol ctc experiencing a pullback and retracement here uh, 30 percent in downside today it would appear after experiencing what we saw yesterday um, you know up to 30 to I believe uh, past 40 percent in upside so uh, what goes up must come down dramatic upside like that is uh, you know sometimes met with uh, similar dramatic uh, downside here so uh, overall very green we do see um, metaverse projects here standing out we do see mana decentraland um, experiencing 16 percent in upside today sandbox up uh, you know 22 percent today um, some very bullish upside for plenty of projects we see um, XLM in the green Cardano in the green as well um, in addition to Litecoin uh, we see um, XRP, um, you know, 2% down today. We're going to touch on XRP in a moment here. Uh, overall price action looking very bullish in my opinion today. Uh, some coins in the red, however, experiencing some healthy downside and some modest, um, you know, pullbacks here. Overall, things are looking very bullish in terms of accumulation. If we zoom out ever so slightly to the week, we're looking at a, um, you know, Thursday in uh, crypto here. Price action looking, um, you know, even more bullish than yesterday. And so we do see, um, you know, continued upside projects experience. Experiencing. Uh, I personally anticipate a continued upside and gains like this based on the sort of uh, month that we've had. Um, I do believe it is time for some, you know, bullish upside here. Um, and so in my opinion, things are looking uh, rather bullish here. It would seem XRP is still very bullish in the week up, you know, 19% here. Um, uh, so we see, um, you know, lots of bullish interactions with the uh, altcoin market so far. Um, Looking at this article on Cointelegraph, uh, we read about a potential bullish incentive for altcoins for, uh, throughout 2022. And they talk about um, some bullish incentives for XRP as well with its recent interaction with $1. Down here, uh, we read about you know, the strong amounts of accumulation for Bitcoin over the last um, sort of several weeks here. Uh, through the sort of uh, technical downside we've been experiencing, it would appear that, um, you, know, um, you know, investors are accumulating um, far more than usual, it would appear, um, against this uh, downside. So there are a lot of buyers present. Um, so that does give a lot of uh, bullish incentive for continued upside and the recovery of what it still appears to be an uptrend even though we have been experiencing this correction and pullback the overall market does seem to still be bullish in my personal opinion and um, in this as well we see uh, down below a tweet talking about um, you know bitcoin's interaction with the 40k range and then um, looking to return to the 50k range here and it talks about a general incentive for you know bullish upside once bitcoin makes a break above 50k and perhaps confirms that as support uh, we can see 50k being a very strong you know psychological key level here that it would appear the market is waiting for further confirmations of uh, down below we see uh, what they refer to as a santa rally that may come to xrp and they talk about its recent interaction with uh, one dollar there uh, they talk about xrp experiencing some very bullish upside over the week over ethereum um, and so this does uh, give a bullish incentive for the continued upside for XRP. It would appear um, starting off the new year uh, strong. So uh, if you want to learn more about this um, article, uh, check it out in the description. Uh, cryptocurrency and XRP looking bullish fundamentally, it would appear. However, technically, XRP is interacting with support and buy signals as well. So this does give um, some potential for bullish continued upside here. Obviously, XRP back above support at 94 cents. That is going to be a key level. We are looking for daily candles opening and closing above to further confirm as support and a potential bullish area of accumulation with these buy signals attempting to return. Uh, we have the buy for with the December 23rd daily candle here, and we even have the bull signal attempting to return with today's daily candle uh, however we do need this candle to close to confirm this buy signal and uh, if we were to maintain this um you know bull suggestion here that would be two of our chosen three robo advisors back to bullish on upside and with price action above support we have an area of accumulation and we can anticipate continued gains here uh, supported by some very bullish technical factors and buy signals once they come back into play so the key levels of resistance i am looking out for here once um you know bullish parameters have 
have been met is going to be potential sell pressure at one dollar and three cents just overhead could be just uh, you know there to give us a hard time however uh, the strongest area of uh, resistance waiting for us is one dollar and 22 cents my immediate short-term target here once support has been confirmed and buy signals remain so uh, we are looking you know more bullish on xrp here technically some factors are coming into play suggesting continued upside however uh, we do need you know further confirmations to be met in my opinion we have been under the influence of sell suggestions ever since the middle of november here our robo advisors of have been uh, technically bearish on xrp ever since the one dollar and four cent level and since those sell suggestions price action has experienced uh, up to 42 percent in downside as we look for you know buy signals to return and support found which appear to be near current levels as we anticipate the next bullish area of accumulation uh, this is what the xrp chart has looked like just about a month ago here on the channel we do see these key levels present near uh, 63 cents in addition to the uh, 77 uh, cent key level both areas of bullish accumulation it would appear here those would have been very bullish times to be uh, buying xrp and if you weren't able to accumulate at those uh, support levels here uh, my next support line at 94 cents could be your next area of accumulation once um, you know these parameters have been met and buy signals can remain in play so let me know your thoughts on xrp down below um, now coin symbol m i r uh, we're looking at price action appearing to be making its way out of a uh, downtrend here interacting with a downtrend line coming all the way back from the middle of may of this year uh, price action has been interacting with it as resistance ever since this break of it throughout the end of october and recently we do see price action returning to it as support here in addition to interaction with buy signals as we find the final areas of technical support uh, before what appears to be a potential bullish recovery upward here uh, back to some you know key levels above um, so uh, if we zoom in we do see uh, price action has been under the influence of sell suggestions ever since the uh, $2.64 level. Since those sell signals, price action did experience up to 21% in uh, downside. However, we do see um, you know, buy signals attempting to return. Uh, we do see one of our chosen robo-advisors bullish on uh, gains here uh, coming into play on the uh, 10th of December. We do need a second robo-advisor to become bullish to allow for more comfortable accumulation. However, in my opinion, I do believe uh, some factors in play here do suggest uh, some upside. So uh, we're looking for continued interaction with key level at uh, $2.49, it would appear. Uh, support could be found here if daily candles uh, continue to open and close with their wicks and bodies above it. Failure to hold this range could bring us uh, down to $2.20 two cents that could be the next area of potential support uh, however uh, down below though we don't have any more key levels except for this descending trend line which has been giving us support ever since the uh, beginning of december here so uh, price action looking for support off of these sort of key levels however we do have resistance overhead waiting for us uh, present at two dollars and 92 cents that is going to be an area of uh, resistance waiting for us that we will have to wait for a break and confirmation of as support uh, to become more comfortable bullish on continued upside here uh, once two dollars and 92 cents has become support uh, my next target and the next area of strong resistance is going to be four dollars and 24 cents uh, right now we are looking for further parameters to be met down below though technically and uh, one more robo advisor to become bullish uh, to allow for comfortable accumulation uh, let me know down below your thoughts on this coin though um, now uh, ethereum interacting with support uh, coming off of key level three thousand nine hundred and twenty three dollars here this has been a bullish area of accumulation for the last few days we do need daily candles continuing to open and close above it though to further confirm it as support and further solidify buy pressure present there uh, we do see one of our chosen three robo advisors becoming bullish on price action uh, this buy one has uh, come into play on the 22nd of december here we just need um, you know one more robo advisor to become bullish to become more comfortably um you know bullish on continued uh upside here however uh with them um, you know sell signals in play we are looking for the strongest areas of support still uh which may not be until three thousand four hundred and fourteen dollars per ethereum uh, right now we are just looking for continued support down below at the three thousand nine hundred dollar level let me know what you're doing with ethereum at current levels we're going to swap over to bitcoin we're taking a look at price action experiencing some nice uh moves upward here uh plowing to and through this uh key level 
level $48,577. Now looking for a potential interaction uh, as support here. Uh, we do see Engineering Robo unfazed by this upside. All three of our chosen Robo advisors are still bearish here. So I anticipate a potential pullback um, until uh, Robo advisors become bullish here uh, because at the moment here we are awaiting you know further interactions with the strongest areas of support as long as sell suggestions are present which have remained in play ever since the uh, 16th of November here uh, so we're looking for continued interaction down below support found off of uh, $48,577 would be very bullish here for us we're looking for a potential interaction with $43,160 per Bitcoin that could also be another area of support waiting for us the strongest area of technical support is still all the way down at $34,655 per Bitcoin and um, you know it would be a whole different story if we were interacting down at those levels but um, so until buy signals remain we are looking for continued interactions uh, downward here so look out for pullbacks in any sort of moves upward uh, we're going to take a look at the fear and greed index here uh, the fear and FOMO zones are used for more uh, longer term investors in uh, cryptocurrency and Bitcoin uh, this does suggest areas of you know accumulation and take profit that you know investors uh, would perhaps consider uh, over uh, the traders that you know capitalize on the short-term volatility uh, these in simple terms uh, green and red bands here are um, you know where perhaps fundamental buy and sell pressure may come into play so in the um, you know green zones we have the fear zone this is where traders are fearful of continued downside and so you want to be greedy when traders are fearful however up in the FOMO zone this is where um, you know FOMO comes into play traders are fearful of missing out and they are buying the tops of you know you know upward rallies here and this is where uh, you know volatile price action may come into play however significant fundamental sell pressure is suggested to be present up uh, in this zone here so this is when investors uh, will be looking to uh, take be taking profits and capitalizing on their longer term gains uh, while um, you know the FOMO is present and everyone is greedy on price action accumulating during the euphoric highs this is when you want to be you know selling and taking profits on your investments awaiting you know more bullish areas of accumulation when prices are low and interacting with support um, so in my personal opinion I do believe the uptrend wants to continue continue I still anticipate an interaction with the FOMO zone uh, $151,000 per Bitcoin is um, still a level I anticipate interaction with here before any sort of a long-term significant downside is to be expected let me know your thoughts down below on crypto currency currently thank you for tuning in thank you for hearing my analysis check out engineering robo for free with a link in the description subscribe here on YouTube check out all the other social media down below and tune in for the next one